This is Derek from Hoosier State Fishing. Um, just wanted to give everybody an update on what's going on. We made it to Chicago. It's only taken seven and a half hours. My friend Chris, his truck is just a pile of shit. Broke down multiple times. Finally made it to the Wendy's that we were driving so long to get to. Um, did really creep out the waiter or the, the drive through worker by saying I was a such a terrible little boy to her. She did not take it well. Um, we're going to continue on this voyage. Hopefully we'll make it to the next Wendy's in about another <laughs> seven and a half hours. Cats out of the back. So uh, we'll be shitting our brains out within the hour from multiple Asiago and <laughs> spicy chicken sandwiches. Chicken sandwich. Uh, can't wait. We'll keep you updated. Thanks, fam. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah. Lace and fam. Okay, well I'm filming. To my right, I have an absolute smallmouth legend. Oh my gosh, Josh is hooked up. Matt Nelson, Josh of Smalley Talk Podcast, Mexican MacGyver. Dude, here we go. Dustin. Are you filming, Josh? Yeah. Uh, uh, yes, I am. Okay, Dustin. Oh! No! Oh no, is that on top water? No, oh, sorry. Yes. I'm trying to get out of your way, guys. I'm sorry. Okay, guys, so complete craziness already. We put, rolled in here at about 4.30 a.m. We had some serious truck issues with Chris's truck, and uh, so we had to transfer his trailer with the big raft and all of his gear into my truck, and uh, we rode four people deep in my truck with all the gear and got here, and uh, that's, that's how we had to do it. And got maybe maybe an hour and a half, two hours of sleep before before we woke up, and so here we are, and we're it's just crazy. So I'm gonna get situated and start fishing. Stay tuned. It's already nuts. <laughs> Let me get this thing there. There we go. Hey guys, let me just give you a quick description of, of why I basically completely blew my chances at, at collaborating and fishing with one of the one of the biggest names in smallmouth fishing on YouTube, uh, AKA Matt Nelson, AKA Indy Yak Angler. So as you guys could see, or maybe you couldn't see, the, uh, the current was so strong and the wind was pushing me so hard that it, I didn't, okay, I guess that's kind of a lie. I did have a chance, I could have gotten out of my kayak and dragged it over, which is exactly what Matt Nelson did to go fish with the guys from Ashigan Fishing, which by the way, real quick, shout out to Ashigan Fishing. Um, they are have collaborated with and are making shirts for Matt Nelson, Indy Yak Angler. And as you can see, this is his, um, this is a shirt design based on his video where he uses a uh, Lego Chewbacca to uh, catch giant smallmouth. So it's pretty cool. Go check it out, ashigonfishing.com. Uh, the official brand of smallmouth bass, link in description. So anyway, back to the um, story where I completely blew my chances. I, um, the current and the wind were pushing me so hard and so fast that I didn't, I did have a chance to get out of my kayak, but I didn't do that because I thought that the river would split, would come back around and meet up again around that island. <sighs> Much to my dismay, that was not the case. And I didn't get to fish with Matt Nelson, Indy Yak Angler one time that entire day except for in the very beginning there for the first five or six minutes whatever so anyway but still a uh, glass half full type of guy that i try to be um i still had an awesome day of fishing caught a bunch of giant smallmouth. so anyway i think that's that's good enough of a description a little bit longer than what i wanted to do so uh without further ado why don't we just go back and jump right into the video all right guys, so I could unfortunately could not keep up with Matt. The current is just ripping through there. It was pretty bad. I'm hoping to catch up with Matt again soon. He's over there. He had to go around this bend. He had to get out of his kayak and pull through that current because it was ripping so hard. Oh man, there we go. What is that? That looks like a pike. Yeah, yeah, pike. Okay, old pesky pike. First fish of the trip. Is a pesky old pike. God. We can do better than that. I know we can. I'm gonna check my hooks, check my line, and we're gonna try this again. 
We've already seen beds. Matt caught a fish off a bed right, right as we were pulling up. So that's super cool. Josh hooked up almost immediately. And it looks like Josh and them hooked into another fish, possibly off of a bed as I was trying to get caught up with Matt. But it's a great sign. So I guess we've got, there's Chris and Danny. They said there's some beds over here and I see it. It's right up there on the bank, right there by that boulder. So here's what I'm gonna use. This is a Z-Man Turbo Crawl. Looks like there's two beds over there actually. I don't see the fish yet. There it is. Okay, I'm leaving this alone. I'm just trying to avoid this wind. <laughs> this wind is having its way with us, or with me. Just fishing anything that looks good right now, and at some point in time, I hope to catch up with those other dudes. I had to abandon those fish on beds. I think there were two or three beds, but the wind kept blowing me into their beds, and I, I could not control my kayak, so I went ahead and abandoned it and let, let Chris and Danny work on those fish. They're definitely aggressive. They're definitely uh, guarding their beds. So should be able to get some good eats today. I'm just, I'm extremely tired. And whenever I get tired, I get like really discombobulated and just kind of unorganized and trying to stay focused. And I'm gonna try to catch up with those dudes so we can, we can all fish together. How cool is that, man? To be able to fish with freaking legendary Matt Nelson of Indie Yak Angler. Pretty dang cool if you ask me. So stick with me, stay tuned. I'm gonna try to find some good fish for you guys. Okay guys, looks like I hooked into a nice smallie here on the smitter bait. <laughs> I was kind of rolling through here really fast and uh, just made a cast and it was a decent smallie, right? First smallie of the trip for me. Oh, it's a good one. It's a good fish. It's a good fish, I'm about to lose my paddle. And I can't, can't grab him. There goes my paddle and my rod. Typical, typical Hoosier State fishing shenanigans here, people. Welcome. Welcome to the channel. Almost lost my glasses. <sighs> Decent fish, though. <laughs> did he splash the camera? I'm sorry if he did. This fish is clearly post-spawn. Uh, feeding up. Got this nice current coming down through here. This little saddle where it cuts through these two islands. And he's just staged up there just waiting for bait fish to come by. And uh, unfortunately he got my spinner bait in his face. So free the fighter, baby. Okay guys, so it looks like we have some beds here. There is so much glare or so much chop on the water that it's impossible for me to see. Like, oh, yep, yeah, there's a fish. Yep, yeah, there are fish on that bed. I'm gonna cast it and I'm gonna swim it, swim it over top of them. Let's see what happens here. Yeah, yep, yeah, he bumped it. I think we've got more over here to my left. And I'm not sure if it's got a fish on it because it seems like it's like something that they, they dug or they fanned out really, really shallow and then kind of changed their minds. Try something different. Got her. Got her. It was the fluke. It's the fluke. Oh, my hands don't want to work because it's so cold. My hands don't want to work. Oh, got her. Got her. <laughs> oh, how about that, guys? Bed fish on the fluke, huh? I won't keep her away too long, but that's a decent fish. Let's put her back on her bed. Right back to it, right back to it. Let's see if there's another one. Oh, I just got bit off by a pike. Yep, that's exactly what that was. All right, I'm gonna retie, regroup, and uh, stay tuned. Just give it one more shot. Hopefully don't get bit off by a pike again. Oh, there's a fish. That's a smallie. Oh my God, that was a giant. That was a freaking giant fish. That was a giant smallmouth. Something got me. Something just took my, something just took my fluke. All right, I'm gonna try a spinner bait over there. Uh, what is this, a stupid pike? God dang it. I have no interest in catching you at all. 
please get off of my freaking line. Man, so annoying, dude. All right, guys, I think I've got another bed right here. I'm gonna try this fluke idea again. I really like the idea of this fluke, especially if they're fry garters but they're definitely chasing stuff off. Yeah, I think that's a bit. And the presence of this, you know, it looks like a bait fish and it looks like a bait fish looming around the bed. And I think that's kind of, that's triggering a big time strikes for sure. If it's even a bed at all. I don't think this is a bed actually. That is not a bed. Okay. Okay, I see a bed right over there and I see a bed right over there. Looks like a pretty decent bank right here. If I can keep my freaking bait out of the trees. Got him. That's a decent fish. Yep. Oh yeah. Saw him go after that. Looks like there's a couple following him too. Oh yeah. Yep. Mm -hmm. Boy, that's a... <laughs> Take that. Well, let's say hi and bye because we're getting blown by the wind. Yes, sir. Nice fish, probably 17 incher. See you, buddy. I'm just using the uh, Venom Lures. Um, what is that called? Venom Lures Skip Shad. Uh, let's keep moving. There's a fish. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay. <laughs> Golly, man. Woo. Yes. Uh oh. Uh oh. Nope. Nope. There we go. There we go, guys. Coughing up crawdads. This is a decent fish right here. This is definitely one of my nicest ones of the trip so far. I'm definitely gonna measure that bad boy. That is a good fish. Let me get the measuring board out. Okay, caught him on a fluke. I'm sorry, I'm trying to keep you guys updated as I fish, but at the same time, I am so tired that it's just very hard to even like collect like legit thoughts like that makes sense. Yeah, 17, not bad. Very nice fish, dude. Very nice. Okay, let's get him back. I think we should do that again. That was fun. Yeah, he coughed up crawdad schmear on me. So let's get a new fluke on. Venom lures, skip shad, and uh, see if there's another one up there that wants to bite. Check my line. Feels pretty good. There might be nests up there or beds or whatever, but I'm just, I'm having a hard time seeing anything because this wind kind of seems like I'm repeating the same problems that I had last trip, but it's true. This wind is putting a chop on the water and it's, it's making it very difficult to see past that chop, so. Oh, oh, yeah, there it was. That was awesome. Oh, there's another one down there. There's another one down there. There's another one. Another one just ate my old fluke that the other one spit out. That is hilarious, dude. Oh, that's so funny. Another nice fish, man. Fluke bike seems to be really, really on right now. The fluke bite, I should say. I said fluke bike. Just another decent fish, probably a 16 or so. Awesome. Go. I just saw one grab it. I think there might be a bed right there. I'm not entirely sure. Got it. 
Oh my god, it's a big one. Oh my god, stay out of my, stay out of my anchor, you son of a gun. This is a good fish, guys. This is a good fish. Oh, that's a good fish. Oh, that's a good fish. Get in my net. Oh, that's a good fish, dude. That is a good fish. Oh, man. That is a great, great fish. <laughs> We're back, baby. We are back in the land of freaking giants, man. 18 and a half inch fish. <laughs> yes. Let's let him go. Kick off. She kicked off. She's good. Oh, man. It's so good to be back. Oh, yeah. It must have been a lot of carp up in here. There's a smallie, decent sized one. I don't know what he's doing up in here. Might have a, met a bed or something. Okay, yeah, there's a big, big, big smallie. There's beds everywhere. Okay, there's one. Yep, that one was chasing my fluke. <clears throat> oh my gosh. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Please get in my net. Oh my gosh, guys. Oh my gosh. What's oh, another freaking giant, dude? Oh my goodness. This one's getting measured, no doubt. 18 and a quarter. I'll take that all day, baby. All right. Okay, she's good. She's ready. Let's see if there's any more out here. Chris and Danny are just tearing it up out here, man. I've been fly fishing all day. I want that known. He's a big conventional guy For the fucking record, I want it known. The biggest <laughs> fish of the day was caught on a fly rod. I want that known. Well, I'll make sure to cut it out then. If you could go ahead and catch a fish. <laughs> you son of a bitch. <laughs> Man, something really moved. Yeah, that was a lot of water that just moved. Let's both cast at it. I got a lead into the wind, dude. Nice, brother. Dude. Quit that. Oh no, get out of my freaking anchor. Get in there. Nice dude. Thanks guys. You guys are the you guys are the men. That's a freaking football. Hey, yeah, he's he's 18. 18 and a quarter. Good call. Yeah, man. Thank you, guys. All right, guys. We've got a couple beds over here. Got him. That was one of them. Oh, boy. Wow. If he gets behind my rods, I'm screwed. Can't let him do that. Can't let him go that way. Nope. Come back over this way, dude. We got one more over here that I'm super close to. I doubt that I'll be able to get that fish. This one here, boy. <laughs> Full energy. My gosh. Yep. We're gonna take a dive on me, huh? Ugh. Got him. That's a good fish. Man, oh man, that one there looks like it's still got eggs, to be honest. That is a great looking fish. All right, guys, 
I think we got a few beds up here over in this area. Got some really, really, really fast current coming through here. Little cut off, nice shallow area, sunlight, warm. I'm pretty sure there's a couple beds. So I'm just gonna make a couple casts. I don't know where the fish are at. Oh, yep. He's got it. Got him. Got him. Oh, that could be a good one. Oh, he's getting in that current. So shallow right here. I'm gonna drag him over here. Oh, he's under a log. He's got me under a log. I'm gonna lose this fish. There he is, right there. Yep, there's several that he just scared out from underneath the log. He got off. He got off. That was him that just took off from underneath the log. No, he's not. He's still on there. He's still on. Oh my gosh. Dude, don't you do it. Don't you do it. He's trying so hard to break me off right now. He is trying so hard to break me off. Yep. I can't believe he hasn't done it yet. That's a big fish. That's a big fish. Please don't. Please don't break off. That's a big, oh my God, that could be a 20, guys. This could be a legit 20 right here. That is a big freaking fish, dude. That is a monster smallmouth. Let's get a quick measurement. And we'll send her on our way. That's 19, no, 18, 18 and three quarter. Let's put her over here back on her bed. There we go, there she goes. Right back to it, right back to it, baby. Okay guys, here we go. We've got beds. Oh yeah, yep. Got him, oh, he let spit it, he spit it out. She's got it. Broke me off, broke me off. That's what you get, that's what you get for not checking your line every single time, Derek. Every single, oh, did she just get the, I think she just got the fluke. Yep, she got the fluke. We're all good. It's all good. I'm gonna put a new fluke on. We're gonna try that again. Okay, guys. Okay, I see her. Yep. Gonna cast way past. So try, try to try not to spook her too much. She's got it. Got her. Got her. Got her. That's a good fish. Oh my gosh, dude. Oh my gosh. She's in that current and she's big. She's in that current and she is thick. Oh boy. Okay, come on. I got, oh my. Come here, come here. I don't wanna drag these fish up on the shore. I really don't. Ugh. You! I really, really wish that I had a weight scale. These fish are so thick. It's unreal. Very nice fish, dude. Nice fish. Let's let her go. There she goes. Right back to her bed. Got a bed right here, right here in front of me. It's a big fish. Okay, I caught this one off camera. I worked on him for a long time. I didn't think he was gonna take it, but he finally did. Or she, whatever you wanna call it. Get in the net, please get in the net. Uh. Ooh. 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 That is a big fish, dude. Dude, that is a big freaking fish. Oh my goodness. Look at that fish, guys. Look at that fish. Let's let her go. There you go. Thanks, fam. <laughs>